actually talk to the rest of the phone to tell them that. The BMS is actually limiting that charge current. I think the next step is to figure out how to bypass this. So on the back side here, these are where the tabs get spot welded on. I want to solder on a wire to each of these sides, and I'm going to run the risk of overheating that, but it, it should be okay. I've done this before. I'm going to use some 8 gauge wire here. Let's pre tin this thing. I'm going to tin this up flat. So let me grab a piece of cardboard. That'll work. That'll work. I'm going to leave this right where it is. But now we have two starting wires and bypass the BMS. Tomorrow, when it's light out, I'm going to take this outside and run the charge at a much higher amperage than the BMS would normally allow us This is a 90 amp 4 volt power supply, variable between about 3.5 and 4.4 volts. I set it to 4.2, which is about the maximum this battery should be charged at. 4.174. Good enough. Needless to say, it's not obvious. Don't try this at home. I'm going to go get a current meter. 